Check out this beautiful wild bass. Welcome to Jack's Meat Shack. Today on the channel, we're cooking a wild bass on the Komodo Joe Classic 3. So our fish has already been cleaned and gutted by the fishmonger, which is handy. So just to prepare it, all I'm gonna do is trim off all these unsavory bits that can be very sharp. So it's just like the fin of the fish. More for presentation, not taste. going to do next using a very sharp knife is make some incisions into the skin at an angle so going down just like that this is so our marinade can find somewhere to settle within the fish now for the marinade I'm gonna use a tablespoon of my ranch all-purpose no added sugar rub, a dash of rapeseed oil, mix it with a spoon. So what I've done by adding the oil to the rub is create a kind of paste that we're gonna to use to flavor our fish. We're gonna push it into the gaps we created with our knife and this will then remain inside the fish when we grill it. The soapstone is a naturally non-stick surface and I've oiled it up ready for our bass to go on. So we're gonna give it a couple of minutes each side just to brown up that skin before moving it onto the left-hand side of the grill in the higher position to finish the fish off. For today's cook, we've got the grill running at 230 degrees Celsius, and we've picked up a nice bit of color on that fish skin. So it's time to move it across to the indirect side of the grill, so the temperature in the fish comes up. The soapstone is also perfect for veggies, so we're gonna throw on some asparagus, that's just been tossed in a little bit of olive oil, salt and pepper, and some sweet corn. And then we are going to serve it all up on a family platter and enjoy our fish. Before we serve the fish, just going to give it a nice fresh squeeze of lemon. Do this at the end because if you do this at the beginning, there is a chance that acid in the lemon could affect the fish. And there we have it, wild sea bass, roasted corn, grilled asparagus, served on a family style platter with a charred lemon. Thanks for joining me. I've been Jack, this has been Jack's Meat Jack. Don't forget, hit me up in the comments if there's anything you wanna see me cook and I will see you all again next week. Bye bye.